Joseph Plus. Hello everybody! Welcome to Outrist Plays. Oh, this is... Okay, let's use this. <laughs> Outrist Plays, let's use a shield. This is not a good selection of items to begin the game with, but we'll see what we get. I uh, just come straight off the daily, which was five minutes long. Apparently I did not need the uh, epic stroller power that was a thing. Oh, you have to kill... Right, we're, we're running this... Um... This new, uh, this new beta build where you have to kill 30 enemies without taking any damage at all. Which is doable at this level of the game, but in future it is not. So we really should try and get as much out of that as we can. Open these, thank you. We have our new... F We've unlocked so many things and many of them suck. Which is the nature of these sorts of games. 400 items in Isaac and you always seem to manage to get camo undies and mom's bra. Don't take any damage, please. Stop throwing things through walls, you cheating cheater. I can't hear you. I am aware that Jen is speaking, but I have no idea what the words are. Story of my life. <laughs> Oh, why did you not... There seems to be a certain sluggishness to the game today. I'm pressing all the right buttons, but... Is it me? They don't seem to be taking the necessary effect. Is there input lag that I wasn't... You know... Able to petition against before it happened? I didn't vote for this. Alright, let's continue to kill enemies without taking damage. And hopefully there's 30 left on the level. Because if not, then this is a highly inauspicious start. Right, because the shield not only is rubbish in every sense of the word, but also manages to cause your roll to be unavailable for a certain amount of time after you've used it. That was fun, but not fun enough to make shields a thing. I have, dude, don't get me wrong, I have watched videos on the internet telling me that shields are good, and in fact explaining how shields can be good, but I don't like them. It's as simple as that. You have 7,000... Oh, do you know what? That's an infantry grenade, which is... Good enough for me, because we've taken red again, because I had a brief, insane period of my life in which we tried interesting <clears throat> different tactics, and I was thoroughly beaten down by every single one of them, because they all suck. Um, <laughs> there's one way of playing this game, and that's hitting things really hard with red items. And, of course, the more things we unlock... The more red items we have that are of an ilk usually reserved for purple items and or green items. So keep playing, unlock you know, shields based on damage, uh, based on uh, brutality uh, and grenades and all that sort of thing. So that eventually you just end up with a completely red run and you don't have to apologise for it. I've, I've replaced my oil thingy with a stabby thingy, but I don't know if it's going to be the best of ideas because the stabby thingy is a little bit harder to enable the crits on, but it kind of seems that at least there are crits. We're going to eat our words if it turns out that not far down the line we find a very good fire synergy, which the oily thingy would have been good for, but right now it's no good for me. I don't need no swords. I don't need no swords. That's no good for me. So... Let's not bother. Please be 30 enemies. I'm... <laughs> I, I'm... I beseech thee, game. No! See, this is why I don't use shields. I was certain in my booties that that was the exact correct time to use the shield and it was not the right time. I have no sense. It's not like I'm really good at Donkey Konga. That's the thing. It's not like I don't have a sense of timing. It's just that nothing in this game seems to honour the expected time. Do you know what? Do you know what then? Let's take something different. We might as well unlock better shields. Stop resetting my scroll, you horrible man. We might as well. Oh, yep, yeah, I want it. <laughs> The awful cudgel, which is terrible, and uh, these aren't interesting enough to spend money on. And this, I mean, this is a purple and green weapon that we've now picked ourselves up. But I'm still gonna keep 
going with the reds because the reds is where it's at. Come on, you reds. So, not a fan of this run to begin with, and I don't really necessarily think it's that, you know, longevitous. That word? Long lived. I don't know if that's going to be any good. For us. Uh, we may have to end up with another one, but that's okay. Is that a wall? Yes, it counts as a wall. Excuse me? Oh, you hold it. It's a channel. Oh, that's interesting. I like this now. We're starting to see that there can indeed, in this game, be primary primary weapons that are not red. Which is gradely and grand. Because... Mm, I think what's going to still continue to happen is we're going to find um, that there are going to be many... Uh, situations where literally the start of the run is going to be the run. It's going to be rare, I should say, that we're going to be able to pivot from what we start with to something else that works even better, mostly because we're going to have um, specced for the things we pick up to begin with. So the more options we have at the start of the run for things to pick up, the happier we're going to be in the long run. So in this case, I've already gone a little bit heavy on the red spec without giving myself really much opportunity to pivot into purple spec. Luckily, this insane Emperor Palpatine Zappy Lightning thing uh, is purple and green. And we do like to put something into green every now and then because that's where all the HP comes from. So, we may want to have a secondary of... Um, Nope. Of, uh, that's 30. Right, I see. It tells me that that's 30 deaths, but it doesn't mean, well done, you succeeded in the deaths thing. It literally said X30 in the new book, so I'm okay with this. Now that I've recognised what's happening, I just want to be really careful for now, considering it like I've got the, the standard curse going on. Because if we get hit, we don't get the door on the next one. And I do believe the door is based on your... Um, the door is based on the level and not on whether you succeeded in the previous one, basically. So I'm pretty sure it's going to be 60 even though we haven't yet had a successful door. We'll find out. If it's only 30, then, you know, great. We sort of win doubly, but... I would like to get to 60 kills without taking damage, if at all possible. And so far, so good, I suppose. Infinity, infantry bow. Oh, yes. This seems good, actually. Because I've already started um, using this as a primary weapon. Can we sell this? We can sell this, because it's not our first weapon. So as I was saying, it's very, very likely that um, the first weapons we get are going to completely define every run that we play. So... If we can get more and more options for the start of a run, you know, we should be using these uh, weapons that we have. More and more options for the start of a run means... Yikes. <laughs> I'm scared. Whew. Use the rune. No. See, I'm not even going to go through those fights because... I have a funny feeling that they will be the death. Um, it means that we can start playing different specs from the beginning, and therefore we don't have to suddenly decide halfway along the line that we should have taken purpose to red, which is what kind of what we're doing right now. Although, the infantry bow is pretty good. We actually have a ranged weapon as our primary weapon, and a melee weapon as our secondary weapon, even though the melee weapon is actually a bow. And the other weapon is not. Okay, bye. No! <laughs> Please. Stop sending everything after me all at once. Nice. That's 60. Alright, we can take damage now. Feel free. I am no longer entirely worried about our situation. I don't want to fight this elite, actually. Oh, and I was going to say I don't have a choice, but I do have a choice. So let's not. Suits me fine. Oh, right, well. Welcome to the new year. It's New Year's Day. It's a uh, quarter to nine at night. How did that happen? I thought it was eight o'clock. 44 minutes have passed without permission. Oh, hello. 
some money for us. And as far as I can tell, it's just another number that we have to remember to write on our worksheets. Oh, this is tempting. But no, we've got a decent run, actually. I'm not going to take what we normally say. Simply because it's nice for once to actually have an opportunity to do something different. And we took damage after maybe 70 ki- oh, come on. 70 kills? You know the pattern of this area. Stop doing the silly thing. Nice. Um, I don't- uh, I didn't even observe New Year's Day except to be around for all these noisy fireworks going off right across the street, which, by the way, pretty sure that should be illegal by now. It's, doesn't it strike anybody as a little bit odd? Well, now we've got an assassin's dagger just straight up available to us. Let's replace our... Mm. 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 I want it. Do you know, I think it might be better than the infantry bow. So I'm going to take it. I sold the infantry bow without even, you know, deciding whether it was better or worse. I can't step behind this thing. Step off, bro. Okay, nice. Um, the same people that are whinging about terrorist attacks all over the country, which is a political topic we're not going to get into, but then they just let us have explosives just because they're slightly shinier. Who's who's not thought of using fireworks for a terrorist attack? It's exactly the right time of year for it. Presumably there's heightened security, but come on, just stop it. Furthermore, there's only like two days of the year where you're allowed to make that sort of noise this late at night. But just, uh, just make it none. I don't have any problem with the concept of fireworks, except for the fact that they're really noisy and annoying and loud. But why not just have it in like a controlled space? You know, pyrotechnic experts are the people who are allowed to have them. Because that's true of everything else. You're not even allowed to wire a plug these days. You know, without a qualified electrician on hand to baby you through every single move. Um, oh, right, <laughs> because he's right. I see. We need one of those. Oh, that reminds me. Did I do another episode after the episode where I had to delete it because halfway through it, they gave me a challenge that I was incapable of beating? I think so. I think I might have whinged on. I certainly whinged about it on Discord. But the question is, did I whinge about it on proper channels like this one? I don't know. Um, yes, let's do this. Uh, yeah, there was a there was a, a door that I couldn't get through, and I needed a different. Excuse me, drinking. I needed a power I don't have because I'm not good enough at this game to beat the final boss. Yay! Um, without being horribly dead all the time. Well, this is interesting, isn't it? We have got an infantry grenade already. We might as well upgrade it. I think that seems fair. The boomerang was a very interesting pre pre preposition. Um, because it goes before another clause of the sentence. But uh, I think I'm going to say no to that. We haven't unlocked any new... Um, Blueprints that I really want to put money into. We've looked at all this. Let us now upgrade this. Yeah, sure. Exploding grenades. Uh, exploding grenades. They tend to explode. That's the point of them. Um, exploding remains. I, I do appreciate. Now I want to take this one as well. Because now I can do hand-to-hand -hand combat. So that's going to be good for us. What was I saying? I was complaining because I managed to get into a challenge area that required me to have a skill that I don't have because of the skill that I don't have. And they didn't have one of those little teleportation stones to get you back out again if you couldn't do it. Uh, which has already been reported. The bug's been reported. And I've whinged about it on Discord, so you don't need to worry about it. I've done everything I can, which is to whinge about it in a completely fruitless and useless channel. Mostly because other people have already whinged about it in what I can hope are fruitful channels, but not being the developers, I couldn't really attest to whether they actually read that or not. So let's just run through this entire level and meet no monsters. That would be grand, wouldn't it? Never tell you about the uh, aliens 
mod for original Doom. In which the first... It was, it was a very early example of... Um, of uh, not jump scares, but like... Um, thriller type... Uh, psychological scares in a video game, even though it wasn't the official video game, I suppose you could say, on account of how it was a mod for Doom. Uh, there was no combat in the entire first level, but there were lots and lots of scary noises. So you spent the whole of the first level just wondering if everything was okay. <laughs> you know, you were going to die anytime soon. They used a similar trick in Doom 3, um, which only really worked if you had the capability of... <laughs> You're really going to pick that up. Yes! Um, shadows! of the Empire. Do you know what? I'm going to swap these over again because uh, I kind of want to use my primary weapon as a primary weapon. I kind of know where I am with it, but the secondary weapon, i.e. this one, nice, uh, it certainly does some damage that we are happy with. You are not allowed to do that, okay? So no. I, it, I would consider that a bug. I didn't hit those spikes. I couldn't have hit those spikes because I went downwards from a position where the spikes were not. It's like the hitbox of the spikes extends beyond the spikes, which I know they don't because I've stood next to them before. Anyway, more whinging about the bullshit of this game. If you don't like it, don't play it. All right, I like it well enough. It just seems a bit mean. I wonder how many enemies I have to kill without getting hit. Hmm. Uh, I haven't found enough enemies. <laughs> I'm gonna ignore you, because I don't really fancy having more things to deal with. Well, I managed to ignore that one, but that's okay. Quick enough with this dagger that it's not a big deal. Also, we can just do that. Don't forget you have actual skills to use. Wow! And this time, you also seem to have. Gameplay skills. Oh, I didn't see that one coming in. Too much stuff on the screen at once. You know what? Fair play to you, game. You mind flooded me. Dagger 3? Um, it might as well be oil. I and mean, we don't have anything that makes fire yet, I think. But, nice. Um, we can now upgrade this, as it's been commented to me. We can, of course, upgrade a 3 to a 3 plus just taking a small hit on the uh, on the power of the weapon until we get to the next juncture, which should be fine. We're okay with this. I am, of course, going to have to fight our favourite boss, the um, conjunctivitis. But now I'm thinking about it, we've not fought conjunctivitis. Um, I don't want any of this, you charlatan. With this zappy thing, and I think it might go really well. Also... Also, also, we have fought conjunctivitis and won several times, so it's not like I have to be particularly concerned about how well we're going to do against it. Although I am a bit because, you know, as people who are trying to sleep can attest to, I have come within an inch of beating that thing. You know, in a, a mano a mano, it's down to the skill level of the... It's in me versus the game, you know, one punch man sort of thing going on here. Oh, I thought I'd roll past it, but I haven't. That's okay. I don't want that, so I'm not going to get it. Uh, and I lost on the last punch of the last fight in the entire game, which, if I managed, would have gone swimmingly, and everyone would still have managed to sleep. Help. Jen's moving on. What? I don't know. We've all been having trouble sleeping recently. No particular reason, it's just time of year, I guess. Let me out. Kill it, kill it, kill it. So apparently that thing starts doing crits as you hold it down. Interesting. Hooray! I was taking damage and I don't know why. Anyway, welcome to the new year. <laughs> Nothing but complaints about the game that we're playing. And... Just tired and complainy and gotta go to work tomorrow and no one wants to and blah blah blah. So, let's 
make the best of our final day off and waste it playing video games. It's not a waste. I play these for your entertainment, not my own. Haha, <laughs> very fun. Ho ho, it is too loud. Nice. I really need to get rid of that mushroom. Where is it? Come over here. Nice. Uh, I was going to say I nearly walked into that um, that old uh, goo there on the ground, and then I just sort of literally stepped into it rather than accidentally falling into it. A thousand times worse, but also a hundred times funnier, so let's go with it. Where are we going? I don't know. There's a scroll of power that I've missed, but I am way too lazy to go back and get that, so let's just continue. What do we need on this run? We need these things to contain something that is of high value. Creative weapons, is this going to be it? Ice grenade? It's better than a stun grenade, I'll give you that. In my opinion, which is always right. Trail of green goo. Not trial of green goo, that's a giant hole. Don't mind if I do. Nice. What is this gross? Whatever this thing is, pretty obvious that it grew. Or evolved or mutated. In any case, I've got a bad feeling about this, Naboo. That was a fun little excursion. Thank you for taking me on that. On that journey through the netherworld. Do we even meet any of these things? I don't know. Is that the final boss sort of thing? You tell me. Alright, let's uh, find our way out of here without taking much more damage. It's very unlikely to me that I'm going to be able to make it through this level. Uh successfully unlocking either door. Am I to understand, now I think about it, that the timed door on f each interim level is basically how long it took you to get... No, that can't make it. That doesn't make sense. I was going to say, maybe... Um, yes. There's only <laughs> there isn't a second one, so okie dokie then. Uh, heck me, I guess. I'm just going to unlock some things. I don't think I want to use this lacerating aura, but it'd be nice to have it sort of available to show up. So I'm just going to unlock things that... Mostly because I don't really think I'm ever going to use them. Like, there's no point at which I'm going to... There's 12 second cooldown. Get out of it. There's no point at which I'm going to go, oh, I'm glad this has shown up. It's much better than the things we've got because it's so easy to get good things. Yeah, that'll do. We have got um, frozen things as well, so that's great. Let's take all of the mutations of red style and get out of here and go and beat the heck out of this boss that we have beaten a million times before and we know exactly what we're doing. At least we can get past the concierge now, <laughs> don't you think? I mean, I know I have to fight it basically every day if I'm going to do the daily, but yeah. when we first started playing, we couldn't... It's all a matter of patterns and, you know, understanding the enemy, right? Uh, and also rolling at the right time. Look at this. That's what I mean. Yo. Get that in there. Sorted, mate. Hit the coloured side, not the spotty side. There we go. Just want to make sure they're not going to... Right. So the trick here... <laughs> coax them up and then stab them. And don't use your roll in case they want to pop up underneath you. At which point, you can roll out of the way. Nice. More of that, please. Don't be tempted to use the roll to get closer to it. Only use it if there's an exclamation mark underneath you, please. Yikes! Yeah, like that. Already used it, you see. Just do this. Yeah, that works much better. Do that all the time. Fact, I think this lightning weapon may be OP. Just have to avoid that. That's okay. I've done it before. Nice. Not going to get much uh, benefit on my cooldowns, unfortunately, because that does require melee kills, I believe. Where are you? Come on, then. Holding that down and just letting the damage happen is... Well, I'll be honest. <laughs> Quite swell indeed. We'll just run around and get them to pop up. 
roll out of the way if there's about to stab you in the butt. And then do all this sort of thing. I see you on the move. Don't you think you can get past me? Oh, you can. Okay. Whoops. Stop taking all this damage. Okay. It's unbecoming of a young gentleman. Don't forget you can always just do this. Okay, that's fine. It didn't kill us when it cropped up underneath us. Oh, why? They're suddenly doing the, za the, dance, the dash attack way more often than they are permitted to, quite honestly. Nice. Gotta, uh, gotta pay attention to those dash attacks. Have that. There you go. Don't come at me. Miss me with those undodgeable versions of that attack, by the way. I'm not into it. Do you even have a back for me to stab you in? Yeah, this. Miss me with this shit. I'm not down with this. At all. Heck. Heck me. Stay still long enough for me to zap you, you incorrigible lunatic. This is all I request of you, is just the time of day. Lovely. Very good. Jolly good, I've been. Hot, hot. Oh, no. What a waste of that. Help. Use this again. We have plenty of this. I've hardly used this flask in this entire run, to be honest with you. And I'm very happy with that, because it means that we're getting at least a little bit better at the game. I mean, there was time when I would just use it several times all at once, right? I... Tried to say goodbye, but I choked. Um, I tried to walk away, but I got hit. What is this that is happening on the side of my screen that you lot can't see? Telling me about don't sleep on the update. Thanks, Windows. This is the last one of these. Last time this happened, we all had a fun, swell time because we all got woke up by the fact that I yelled at the top of my lungs about <laughs> the final hit versus final hit sort of nonsense that was going on. Some sort of Troy-like 300 level you know, Hercules task of not being... Look, just stop trying to be poetic. Also, stop trying to hurt me so much. Ow! Why can't I use it? Because it's not ready yet. It's gonna happen again, friends. Stop it! <laughs> I haven't got time to hit you. I can't swing as fast as you require me to in order for this to be effective. They only pop up for a couple of seconds. Not even a couple of seconds, like half a second. I'm just really worried about, yeah, exactly that happening all over my face. Get out of the way! Yes! Right, there's only one of them now. Get these hits in. Nice! Oh my god, he's not dead yet. This is the worst day of my life. <laughs> Everybody, just stop watching. Wowee! That was interesting. This pop-up will not get off my screen. Just never. No. I don't want to restart. It's been an entire Christmas and you haven't restarted. And I just get home and want to play a game and you just want to restart all the time, please. Can't sell that. Should be able to just sell it. Only 2,000 gold! I don't know what to say. That was really, really hard. The cooldown time on that lightning thing, not the cooldown time, like the spin-up time, is something you really, really have to get used to. So I'm going to have to hopefully have another go with that. What have we got? We've got Haber use of boots and the boomerang. In the daily, we saw the Haber use of gauntlets. So it's possible that there's just new items I didn't know about in the beta, or maybe they showed up in an update that happened when I wasn't here. But either way, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed the episode. I'm not going to keep going on. You know, so many people... 
It has been mentioned to me, and I fully agree, nobody presses like or subscribes because the person at the doing the video said press like and subscribe. So I'm not going to say that anymore. I'm just going to say thank you for watching. I hope you can understand me, even though I'm getting more and more tired and I'm dying in this sweater that I need to take off. And until the next time, I'll see you.